He knows the way. Oh God. <laughs> I wake up, flex, I'm down that check. No drip, this wet. Tell him run it up. No sleep, no rest. Might crash, might wreck. Birthday vacation time. Yay! Okay, so I have flown into Atlanta so I can fly from here to Hawaii with my good friend Kavia. She is currently collecting the rest of the packages I have forwarded to her house because they wouldn't get to me on time before we get to Hawaii. And then we're going to have dinner and then i think we're going to watch the last episode our most recent episode of love is blind together i'm supposed like, to be a good vlog at this trip bad i don't want to like hurt you yeah. Yeah. yeah okay so it's a little before three o'clock in the morning we are packing up all of our things so we can head to the airport to start our journey to hawaii this is the vlog vlog this is the vlog vlog. This one reels with silence. <laughs> no, it's not. It's okay. Oh, so we are flying from here to Vegas and then from Vegas to Hawaii. It's it's a twelve hour travel time, but when I'm laying on the beach in Hawaii, it will all be ready. All right. So it's like around maybe five thirty and five thirty ish. Kavi and I. So how's the people, Kavi? Hello. <laughs> <laughs> We are waiting for our first flight out to Vegas. Will be residing. Closet. <laughs> no worries. <laughs> and then we have sitting area, living room, the balcony. Which is beautiful. <laughs> no struggle. <laughs> Breakfast out here. The kitchen. So exciting and there's a second bedroom guys because we have um a premiere bedroom suite oh there's a second bathroom and this is the second bedroom oh it's another bathroom mm -hmm. and then okay so now that we are all checked in i am going to take the master bedroom um, I'm going to start like unpacking my clothes so I can see all my outfits and like know what I have so In this luggage piece because on Southwest you can have like two checked pieces of luggage and a carry-on So what I did was in the medium-sized luggage piece I packed my carry-on and this one's full of all my stuff that I used in Atlanta This way going home. I can use this as my carry-on I'll have this medium-sized luggage piece and then my larger piece This was just like a little hack for me to be able to bring three luggage pieces Without having to like deal with all three on the way up here and that worked out really well. I was talking to my vlog <laughs> Right now, I'm just putting all my clothes away in my closet. This way I can see like my outfits, um, what I have to wear. I decided on this vacation, I do not know the meaning of the word casual. I look a little crusty right now because I've been traveling for the past couple of days, but honey, we about to pull it together. I brought like five styles. We brought Celia. Who this? We brought Chelsea. I brought, don't play with me, my other ones. Uh, Maximina, because that was going on a ponytail, it's a 360. Um, I bought my 32 inch straight. I don't know, what do you got? Child All right, so Kavia and I are exploring in Hilton Village. We need to go pick up some essentials, mm -hmm. find some dinner on the beach. I did my press on nails, so nobody's talking like this because we're a fancy lady like Kavia. Let's go. looking dry girl not this acne scar standing out and saying hello girl like 
who told you you could come along not i it's like midnight back home so your girl is wiped and i've been traveling a lot over the past couple of days so we placed a target order to like get some groceries in the room and whatnot like you know basic stuff um water some ginger shots for me because i do a ginger shot every single day um some shears so i can cut the lace on my other wigs that i brought and just like a few other essentials and we'll probably like venture to the market tomorrow because like i gotta see the snacks before i purchase them and then i think tomorrow we're gonna do like a beach day do some shopping and then we're going on a sunset cruise it's going to be fabulous <laughs> stock like well before this trip so we have like an idea of what we'd be doing each day and then i also made like a tab in there that has all different restaurants that i've looked up on tiktok because tiktok is great for research purposes um places to go things to eat and then i broke it up by like dinner lunch food desserts and put like little and i put the link to like each tiktok i saw in that document as well this way we can refer back to it um i'm gonna put on the chelsea wig this is from sensational's wet lace collection color balayage mocha and fashion by 16 to apply my wig i brought some glueless lace spray i did test it out back home and it worked well so hopefully it does not fail me out here and these are nice straight towel because i cannot be out here looking crazy i'm here to be cute i'm here to be fabulous i'm here to serve the looks okay by the way these wristbands that i have on this is like pre-clear stuff so we flew southwest um they have like a program here safe travels hawaii for tourists that are coming in they want to make sure that like you know everybody's observing the protocols which is really important right now you bring like your vaccine card whatever route that you've gone you can read all about it on the hawaii um safe travels website i brought my vaccine card i uploaded all my info so southwest pre-cleared us to come into hawaii this is important because um when you come through the hawaii airport they're checking to see who has a wristband that is already cleared to like come through and i'm assuming that if you're not already clear there's a whole process that you'll need to go through so if you are able to do pre-clear i would definitely encourage it and then our hotel had like a similar process basically they saw that we had already been cleared we again showed like our vaccination cards things like that and then the hotel themselves gave us another wristband that we need to keep on while we're here this way like as we're going into restaurants or going places like they know that we are already set and cleared to be there um because i think most basically most places here are going to check like your vaccine card or probably ask for a negative test okay. i'm going to go take my first proper look out the balcony because i've never actually been out on it let's see Ooh, this is gorgeous this is absolutely gorgeous. So today we're going to go shopping. Tomorrow will be the major beach day. Kavia, who is just a wonderful friend and travel partner, might I add, had the brilliant idea that I should take a picture down. <laughs> downstairs in high heels because you know i didn't want to hold us up from going to get breakfast by like asking but since she suggested i had to take her up on the offer so i'm gonna go get an outfit picture here's kavia and we are gonna go take my picture and then we're gonna go get breakfast or brunch at this point but food nonetheless brunch at this really great restaurant called Scratch. It's back there. Oh, so good. I got their milk and cereal pancakes. What did you get? I got the creme brulee french toast, the deviled eggs that were deep fried, and the guava cocktail. And it was all amazing. Everything was so good. Definitely recommend. And it's not far from our hotel. And it's actually also right next to Ala Moana Center, which is where I'm going shopping today. I'm very excited. And then over yonder, they have a Nordstrom rack and like a 2D max in that area too. Okay, so we have found out essentially with Louboutins, I can really only do, I guess, like an open-toed shoe. Um, I thought I was gonna be a 41 across the board because there's a pair that I've had my heart set on. I went to try it on, they didn't have a 41, but like a 40 and a half, way too tight, 42, way too big, and he honestly said the 41 might not even really fit me. 
but when I tried on one of the open toe styles, um, the four and a half fit me beautifully. So it seems that I might not ever have a really extensive Louboutin collection unless they do a lot of great things with the open toe shoes. So now I must decide, am I gonna focus on bags? Or they have the same shoes, I think, either at Bloomingdale's or Nordstrom here, so I can try them in a 41. This dress reminds me of that Sex in the City dress that Carrie wore that one time. And I found like some cute shift dresses. We're gonna see how this goes. why I went to um, St. Laurent here to get these. Um, so first of all, these were like the little wristlets that some of the girls have been buying instead of getting the bag because the bag is super expensive. But if you get the clutch, um, like the wristlet, it's like half the price. Anywho, here in Hawaii, they have something called a Hawaii price. To kind of like accommodate the whole situation with like conversion in terms of currency here, because I guess like there are a lot of people that stop here from other countries and other places, they do something called the Hawaii price um, discount in some designer stores. So in St. Laurent, it was 10% off of the original price. And then I think their sales tax here is about like 4% or something like that. So basically it's like getting a discount when you shop at the designer stores here. Almost all the designer stores I want to say do it. So like Dior, I'm pretty sure. Louis Vuitton, St. Laurent, a bunch of the designer stores here do that Hawaii price. So that is why you'll see a lot of people buy designer pieces here in Hawaii instead of like on the mainland. Um, I'm going to touch up my makeup, I'm going to touch up my hair, and then I'm going to put on my outfit for a sunset cruise. Also, so you see this like bluish cast that I have going on right now? Last night when we did our Target order, I ordered another sunscreen. This is a mineral sunscreen by Bear Republic. Um, I got this one simply because I was trying to find something that said, it was like the whole coral reef thing, coral reef safe. Because I didn't see like that marking on the sunscreen I brought here and I really wanted to like respect that rule. But that sunscreen, maybe because it's a mineral sunscreen, it's left my skin with like a bluish cast and I think it's because the sunscreen has like a white cast to it so I feel like I'm low-key giving growth sister a la the proud family and that's not what I came to give so I need to get another sunscreen that is coral reef safe that does not do this to my skin because that's that's not the look that I'm trying to give um this is the stuff I sent to Kavia's house so this was not in my real um showing my vacation outfits I got this red bodysuit from Fashion Nova. I basically got it because I needed something with this bright red and then I wanted like a side cutout, something that's like kind of sexy but not like too much. Um, I am noticing it is pretty low though, so I hope I hope it looks okay. These red fringe pants. These are from, I think the store is called Mina Monroe. On Instagram, I know she has like a few different handles, like More Money Mina something or other but I want to say the brand is yeah Mina Monroe so she does like these fringe sweatpants that are really cute I got the red ones in candy apple red and the straight leg they come in straight leg and they come in wide leg um the cruise leaves at five we're taking the sunset cruise on peak sales Waikiki and we found a group on for it so we got a really really good deal I think totally we paid like sixty dollars uh, for both of us and I want to say originally the price was a hundred bucks or something regular price so I found it on Groupon and then Groupon had an additional coupon. That's the tea girl. If I can still find the deal, I'll link it below in the description box for you guys. Okay. It was definitely the nude eyeliner that was throwing me. I should have changed it earlier because I low key thought it might be, but I wasn't sure. And this is why you should always trust your gut, y'all. Like I felt like something about the nude eyeliner was making me look a little crazy and see how it's like night and day right now when I was looking like before when I was in this camera because I was like, why do I look like I don't know how to do my makeup? Like... Beautiful ocean view, like that is so good. So good. 
Okay, so it's our second official day in Hawaii. Today is Thursday. This is also the day that they're gonna turn off the water in the hotel um, and the air conditioning um, actually at nine. So it's about seven right now. So in two hours, there will be no water or air conditioner until about two o'clock in the afternoon. So <laughs> I think our plan today um, was just to go do things out and about in Hawaii so that like, we're not here without water and air conditioning. So, like that means, you know, you can't wash your hands, can't use the toilet, you can't shower, can't do any of those things. So I need to really go do that. Okay, so I have the tub filling up in the background so we'll have at least some water to be able to like wash our hands or something like that. I have my bathing suit on and I have a matching bucket cap for this. For my wig, I'm really trying to avoid a tan line because I can't wear makeup to work due to the nature of my job. Um, so I have a wig fix band underneath it and then I put a couple of bobby pins. Hopefully I'll be nice and secure. Um, I'm going to finish getting dressed and then we're going to go get breakfast. After that, we're going to go to the beach. We're going to go to the one near the hotel. When we checked in, let me turn this water off. When we checked in, they did give us also like in our welcome kit some passes, I think for the beach, the pool and like a pool towel, something like that. I didn't really read a child. I just saw a beach and towel and I was like, okay, cool. <laughs> Made it to the beach. They have like um, chair and table rental, chair and table, umbrella and chair rental, and they actually set it up for you. So we got one of those. It was $25? Yeah, for two hours. For two hours. I was suddenly regretting not purchasing my summer foundation shade yesterday at the um, Ala Moana shops, but it's fine. It'll be fine. I already know I'm gonna be like my summer color by the time we leave here today, but. It's all good. And thankfully it's not windy, so the air is secured. So as you can see, went to the beach. I got quite the tan. I'm someone I don't typically burn, but I tan very, very easily. Um, we were only on the beach for about two hours really um and i got super tan and honestly i was under the umbrella for like some of it like the left side of my body was kind of exposed it wasn't the whole thing um so i feel like the tan line stronger on this side than on this side we are still going to go to the beach the next two days as well so i am going to have to even it out like i even have the tan lines on my wrist from having the wristbands on while I was at the beach. Um, conveniently, my face powder is a little bit darker than me anyways. I use the Charlotte Tilbury um, Flawless um, Finish Airbrush Powder. I use the shade 3 underneath my eyes and then I use the shade 4 on my face, which is a little bit darker than me, so I'm hoping that'll help everything like really blend in um, as I do my makeup. Because like, yeah, God, I really need to blend here. Um, whew, I want to powder. I'm using the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Finish Setting Spray. I quite like that and I really was going for like something soft and natural for this evening because I didn't want to take too long to do my makeup this way and we weren't late to get to the stores because it's about 5 30 ish right now and I want us to be able to have time to do everything. Alright, so once again, things closing early and us overpacking our schedule. <laughs> We're going to dinner. We're gonna go to Jolene's, which is in Chinatown. So I really want to check out Chinatown based on what I've seen on TikTok. And I heard the food at Jolene's is good. Yes, it's seafood. Yes, I'm getting a lobster roll. Yes, I can get that in Rhode Island, but I'm not in Rhode Island. I'm in Hawaii. I want a Hawaii lobster roll from Jolene's in Chinatown. Katie. Okay, I'm here to be a background dancer. <laughs> so, we're heading out for our lift to pick us up so we can get to dinner and it says I'm getting a notification. Alright, let's go. Okay. The plan today is to leave earlier. We're gonna go to a different beach. I have my official birthday like beach outfit that I'm gonna take some pictures in. Today is also the first day that we have housekeeping. So like I tried to clean up a little bit cause I don't want them, you know, to think I'm a complete slob now, child. My mama didn't raise me in a barn. Around these parts, we have some decorum, okay? 
if you're not on TikTok, that probably wasn't as funny as it should be. Anyways, <laughs> bathing suit of the day and my sun hat is from Shein. It was like 13 bucks and I got it in orange as well. Um, I did not bring the orange one because I didn't bring the orange outfit. And then I will show you guys my cover up as well. It's going to be really cute for my pictures. And this bathing suit is so, so cute. Beach dress. Um, which is really like a nude mesh dress from Fashion Nova with like all the rhinestones. I want to say this is like $30. It has like rhinestones and pearls over the nude mesh. And I already showed you guys my bathing suit. Um, let me get my bag together and then it's off to the beach. This is the outfit I want to wear for my official beach birthday pictures. that I want to finish up and then we are gonna get ready at the hotel, hair, makeup, and then just shopping which I'm excited about. And then we're gonna get dinner later and we might check out like some events that are happening around town. I'm in a Facebook group and I like, ask them what are some popping things that are happening right now this weekend in um, Hawaii and they did send me like some flyers for things so we might go check those out. Okay, yeah. Ooh, yeah. We're gonna rinse off, enjoy the water a little bit more, and then we're gonna head back to the hotel, start getting ready, um, get some food, cause your girl is hungry. And then we're gonna go do the shopping that we've discussed a few times now with this vlog. But right now, it's back into this beautiful water. Ready to We're gonna take a quick photo, and then we're going shopping! Material girl, I wish you now now, boo. I was gonna tell you that you ate. Material girl! Can I get it from my mammy us now? Can't sell me material girl. That's all I got for you. Like, it just lights up my face. So, when you look at these pictures of me in this outfit, and my face don't really match my body. Oh, I thought you were Mind your business. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, honestly, I went to the beach for the second day today and I am now extra, extra tan. So we need to get to the mall so I can get my summer foundation shade because while the finish of this is beautiful, it is very clearly not my shade. I just need to get one good outfit picture and then we can go. That's all I need. Just one. One small outfit picture. And we actually, I need to hurry up so I don't make us late because things are gonna be closing. We're gonna be in the same predicament again. <laughs> We have made our way back to the Ala Moana shops, doing some returns, doing some shopping, and then we're gonna head to the Royal Hawaiian Center because there are like more stores down there. And that's also more of like an open area mall over here when you're like Dior, Material Girl. Let me stop. got a tan so while I would normally get this color it's looking like I probably need this color instead you would still get this color okay and even that this <gasps> I didn't mean to offend you <laughs> I'm just are you just telling facts. me to use the regular band-aids okay no let's just no no I'm just saying, that one might be too dark for me though still no possibly I don't believe too so do you feel like this one actually shows up as this color it might be lighter. Okay, because my assumption is that... Well, look on camera, because if you look on camera... No, no, my assumption is that this band-aid, like, when you get this band-aid, is it this color to the T? Because my assumption is that this band-aid is a little lighter than what it's showing in this okay, picture. Okay, let's get that one. Yeah. It's going to be on my toe. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Oh, my foot's darker. Yeah, let's yeah. get that.
my first scent by who is this by montal paris i got vanilla absolute this smells delicious if you like sweet scents i love vanilla scents so that's why i got this this smells amazing i'll do like a review video on it anyways so now we're gonna go out to dinner we're going to this place called herringbone we got recommendations for a few places but we decided to go with herringbone um they're one of the few places we can still get a reservation for tonight um so we're gonna go there and our reservation is actually in probably less than a half hour so i need to move this along i brought two outfit options for like our bad and bougie night out my sexier outfit is this nude mesh um black leopard print jumpsuit from naked right. Wonder. got my jumpsuit on shoes zara bag i have a mask ready to go So we got dinner at Herringbone. Going out is not happening. We are both tired, is that fair? Yes. We're both tired and honestly my back hurts. Like, your girl can't do it. But tomorrow, sunrise hike. Color, she can probably make one little bit of turquoise. Never white though, never white. I know that. All right, so <laughs> I have three degrees, okay? I have three degrees. <laughs> I could cook from scratch. I can clean. I just don't do the laundry at home. So like, I, I know like basic fundamentals. <laughs> For the loads, if you have a small load, mm -hmm. use one packet, mm -hmm. medium load, two packets, mm -hmm. large, extra large, three. Okay, so- I'm assuming you got small loads. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so like my brown things that are like a camel color, can I wash that with things that are black and gray or no? Yes. That has to go with light color. Yes. No, it would be dark. So when I think light, think bright as well. So pinks. Pastels. Pastels, um, hot pinks, yellows, oranges. Those colors that tend to bleed more. Jeans, blacks, grays, okay, I should wash my jeans separately then. I have jeans as well. That's you should put them with blacks. Okay, but what about those camels? Like the Vavor skin set that I wore? Yes, sir. Darks. The day I came to Atlanta. Don't recall. Darks. Oh, but you can split them into two bottles and we can look at them before you put them in. Okay. And then, washer. You're just doing your normal load. <laughs> and then you'll hit, um, actually, what temperature do you, never mind. I don't, I don't think it's too hot because I don't want to miss my clothes. Um, so okay. I tend to do, Hold on. Should I put on like a delicate set of clothes and this will work? No. <laughs> it's a good question to ask though. You don't learn unless you ask questions. So a lot of it is more um, when it comes to the dryer. Okay, so yes. a lot of I do know that one. Yeah. Yeah. If you have, if you like it, leave it to hang dry. That's my rule. Oh, okay. <laughs> if I even with my, um, my fitness wear, mm -hmm. I leave a lot of that to hand dry. Yes, so I will wash this later because it's gonna have dirt on it. Okay. From the hike. So this is on except on cold. Okay. Spin is on high. So level is normal. Sure. <laughs> um, yeah, so you're good to go. So All let's right. put you into two piles there, Miss Terrasin time. And what I brought out, I've been keeping like my dirty laundry to the side of my room. So I'm gonna try and wash like my bathing suits um clothes to wear home because <laughs> i didn't bring like a second to the airport clothes oh so Aww, your mother is so sweet oh yes my mom did text Marilyn and say that her mom her mom my mom and your mom have been praying for us daily i took it as they're praying for the lord's protection upon us okay katie um, said two piles so we're gonna start with like, the darker brown so like the bathing suit i wore yesterday my bathing suit that I wore at my first beach day. Um, not gonna show y'all my drawers because we're not on that type of time. Um, my leopard print pajamas, because those are a light color. Um, dark green should be able to go in there too, I should think, for earth tones. This shirt that I wore on the plane, this bra that y'all don't need to see. My drawers that y'all need to see. We'll put the hot pink drawers in the other pile. The jeans should probably get washed separately. Gain a fling. Wait, 
do. I'm just toss it inside. Uh, all right, add packs to drum. Okay, well, good thing I didn't do what I was gonna do because I thought I was supposed to put it in there. Add packs to drum. Where? Which one does it tell you? Kibia! Um, which one should I put the game fling in? Uh, which one should I put the game fling in? Oh, so with the package, you throw them directly into the drum. You don't have to take it Oh, <laughs> LOL. So, yeah. There we go. Alright, fabulous. Add clothes, clothes package after use. Fabulous. Alright, so, turn you back on. Don't laugh me at home. Mm -hmm. I know I have to put it in the drum and then I wouldn't look for this thing, but that's going to be here there. Um, All right, so turn it normal. Yeah. Yeah, look at me. Bring it down to a cold wash with the temp. For the fun. Mm -hmm. Go. Go. Oh, <laughs> Spin. Um, but everything else they have is fine. Okay. And then just press play. <laughs> Look at me, guys. I'm doing laundry. I don't cry. I'm domesticated now. I'm not. I'm a domesticated woman. So do I. Lord. <laughs> All right. So we're gonna go on our hike while the laundry does itself. Just realized I didn't use my asthma inhaler, <laughs> and I didn't bring it. That's why I had a backpack. I'm just gonna pace myself. <laughs> easier for those of us who are not super athletic at the moment meaning myself cable is super athletic but we made it to the top and it is absolutely beautiful up here definitely well worth the experience you should definitely check it out if you get the opportunity to now i don't know if i could do this twice girl i'm already looking for the elevator to the bottom i know there's not an elevator but, no i'm just being funny I'm, I'm looking for the elevator to the bottom because you know got asthma and my legs is hurting we made it back almost to the bottom. Oh. I'm proud of us, Kivia. I am proud of us as well. I wonder how many calories we burned today. Because I haven't eaten anything yet. I didn't even drink the water because I didn't want to have to pee, to be honest. <laughs> and I forgot to take my ginger shot. I think next we're going to try to do Lennon's Bakery to get the masadas. I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. Um, John, I'm going to eat too. water so I can hand wash these things. These are those pants I had on yesterday from Fashion Nova. And what I was trying to do, they make these snap things that they sell at Walmart that you're supposed to be able to stick on the inside of your fabric and then like snap it so that you can like hem your pants for the day if you need to. The problem is I've had mine for a while and I didn't know that the plastic had come off of some of them. So they weren't all sticky. So I didn't have enough to like really actually hem my pants. So what I did was like I took a clear elastic hair tie last night. I tried everything. I tried bobby pins because like I didn't bring a needle and thread. I do know how to sew. Um, I couldn't get them to stay, and I actually put a little hole in these pants somewhere yesterday with the bobby pin. Yeah, right here. Trying to fix it. Where'd it go? It's not super noticeable, but I just saw it a second ago. 
I said, let me just go ahead and wear it and I'll just find a way to finesse. So I'm just gonna get a game fling and I'm gonna toss it in there and I'll swirl it a little bit so I can hand wash this load. So we have made it to the Joel Plantation. We're checking out what they have over here. There's like a train that you can ride. There's a gift shop and there's like a lot of good stuff. I definitely see a lot of candy and stuff that I want to buy. Um, um, so let's see what else that they have. So you know our call and response. Like Other than if good. we get lost, Kavia, you have to yell out, Material Girl! Uh, I don't my book! Yes, I'll if, call and respond. But if you. I find you, I want Chanel 9. Oh. I mean, that's not in today's budget. I got you, like, maybe a couple years from now on your birthday, but not today. <laughs> so we're in the maze, and now we need to find our way through. Um, ready? Yep, let's go. <laughs> Onward. <laughs> Found one of the first secret station thingies with our code. Good job, Katie. Expert navigation skills. Are you a Girl Scout by any chance? <laughs> Follow Rafiki. He knows the way. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, what I was going to say is what this reminds me of is like, remember uh, Vacation Bible School? Oh. That's what this is reminiscent of. Vacation oh. Bible School. This does seem like a vacation Bible school. Mm-hmm. To go through the maze. This is a video. I just want to let you know we found some. <laughs> I will be putting this on everything. Expect wings soon to come. You won't be invited. Except for Teresa. She was there for the founding. Ah, oh, thank you. But See. It's going to be so good. This and lemonade. And I'm going to order some more on Amazon, too. <laughs> <laughs> Our stuff from the Dole Plantations. I just took a shower because I saw a bug crawling on my shirt when I returned from the Dole Plantations. But I said to me, it's time to get cleaned up. Um, I need to pack. Like I started last night, but I need to pack everything else up. And then tomorrow we are leaving Hawaii. And I'm really sad about that because it's been absolutely beautiful. I've had a great time here with Kavia and I'm having a great time in Hawaii in general. We were here for five days. I flew in the day before to Atlanta. From Atlanta, we flew to Hawaii. And I don't know if I mentioned this, we got a really good flight deal. Southwest had a deal back in October, 2021, that if you booked a flight to Hawaii using their promo code, you got 50% off of your ticket price. So we got round trip tickets from Atlanta to Hawaii for like $300. And then because I have a Capital One Venture card, I had like all these like travel reward points. I basically only had to pay like $100 of my ticket because I had like a bunch of points that I could use to sort of wipe out that purchase. It's a really great travel card, by the way. We have ordered our lift for our last dinner in Hawaii. Little OOTD. It's the old Zara dress. James for the Rosace Athenia heels. Thanks for everything. Of course, it'll be in the description box below and on my blog as well. Katie's up featuring her fringe pants. So festive. Yes. So fabulous. Club flowers on the Amy sauce. So. Okay. okay, we just returned from dinner. We went to restaurant 604 can't say i'd really recommend but it was a nice way to end our evening i'm really really sad that like our time is over now i would definitely love like a few more days here because everything is so beautiful and there's still so many things that i want to do i'll have my stuff hanging like to air dry there and then i need to like dry those pants this way i can pack them up it'll be nice to go home with my laundry being basically clean um and yeah, we still have the butter mochi from Leonard's that we're going to try after Kavia takes a shower and whatnot. And yeah, yeah. I'm pretty sure that we're gonna need to leave around like four o'clock in the morning uh, for our flight. Right now it's 10.52, so it's gonna be an early evening. I'm tired. <laughs> Um, but yeah, we're going to need to leave for the airport around 4.45 because our flights are on 7. Right now it's about 11 o'clock at night here, so um, I'm definitely, I'm definitely going to be sleeping on the plane. Butter mochi time! Alright, so we are all packed up, ready to go to the airport. I've just been walking through to see, like, make sure I didn't leave anything behind. It's 5 o'clock in the morning. 
Kevy and I are both ready. Thank you. I'll the luggage scale. It's the last thing I need to pack away. Lock up my luggage. We have all our bags there. I even I even dried more of the delicates this morning, guys. <laughs> Look at me. Um, yeah, that's it. Oh, uh, and our donuts for breakfast. We still have those. But now we are going to head out to the airport. Um, we're flying into Vegas and from Vegas to Atlanta. Now we're gonna head to the airport um, to make our way back to Atlanta and then I'll make my way back home tomorrow. Hawaii has been absolutely amazing. If you ever have the opportunity to go, you should. There are four islands, I believe. We did Oahu. I love it here. You, I definitely need more time here. And honestly, if you're gonna do a bunch of islands, you need a bunch of time in each one. Don't think you can come in and do it like in a day or two now. You need a good amount of time just to really take Thanks it. Thanks for watching my 30th birthday trip Hawaii vlog. If you guys have any questions, you can leave a comment down below and I will get back to you. You can catch me on Instagram, Snapchat, TikTok, Twitter, Pinterest, all the places, Chala, and Fly Face Fab everywhere online. Thanks for watching. Stay snatched and I'll see you next time. Might crash, might wreck, but first I stretch. I run it all. I wake up. Flex. Thumb down that check. No drip this. Tell him run it all. No sleep, no rest. Might crash, might wreck. But first I stretch. Tell him run it off.